Uh, yes, just uh, sad news here tonight, you guys. Uh, her rep has released a statement saying that Hesh is brain dead, which in California means that you are legally dead. And her family released a statement saying that she will be deeply missed, but that she lives on in her beautiful sons and her iconic body of work. You know, he comes home all hours of the night without announcing when and why, where he's been for the last three months. From films like Donnie Brasco to Six Days, Seven Nights. Dare blame this on me. If you were half a pilot, we wouldn't be on this island. And TV shows like Men in Trees. Three uh, what are you making here? Bonus kayak. Actress Anne Hage has been acting on the big and small screens for decades, starting with her Emmy winning performance on the soap Another World. You are a part of me. I am me, Vicky. Unfortunately, the injuries she suffered during a fiery crash in Mar Vista last week have claimed her life. That's according to her rep, who says she suffered a severe brain injury and has been declared brain dead and only being kept on life support so any viable organs can be harvested. There's no chance where there'll be any kind of cognitive, physical, or functional improvement. So, yes, I, that's what we consider brain dead or or dead. Videos captured Hafe driving erratically last Friday before she crashed her Mini Cooper into a home. Police say her blood test shows she had narcotics in her system, which TMZ says were cocaine and fentanyl. A statement on behalf of her family and friends says, today we lost a bright light, a kind and most joyful soul, a loving mother and loyal friend. The 53-year-old leaves behind two sons, 20-year-old Homer Lafoon and 13-year-old Atlas Hache. Homer released a statement saying, My brother Atlas and I lost our mom. After six days of almost unbelievable emotional swings, I am left with a deep wordless sadness. Hopefully, my mom is free from pain and beginning to explore what I like to imagine as her eternal freedom. And comedian Ellen DeGeneres, with whom Haish had a headline-grabbing three-year relationship with, tweeted, this is a sad day. I'm sending Anne's children, family, and friends all my love. And in light of this news, the LAPD says that they will no longer be investigating this case. For now, reporting live here in West Hills, Mary Beth McDade, we're going to send it back to you guys in the studio. Mary